What's going on, Sartorialist? Welcome back to the Holsey Style. I hope that your holidays have been fantastic and stylish, and I hope that you are having a restful, enjoyable end of the year. With that said, what we're gonna be doing today is taking a look at my five favorite outfits from Christmas Day. It's the first time I've done a video like this where I've analyzed outfits from only one day, so I'm quite excited about it. Let's get into it. My first favorite outfit from Christmas Day comes from the Instagram account R86234, which is an account that you guys should be familiar with if you've been watching my outfit analysis videos. But in the photo, he is wearing a tan G9 Barracuda jacket, a white OCBD, a black zigzag knit tie, Savelle's jeans with white socks and black tassel loafers. What is most appealing about this outfit to me is precisely its iviness. Everything about it is ivy. The tan G9 Barracuda jacket is, of course, an iconic piece, and it was popularized in Hollywood in the 1950s and 60s when the ivy look was quote unquote in. It was worn by such great actors as Steve McQueen and Paul Newman. But what I also like about this jacket, in addition to its iviness, is its, so to speak, Christmassiness. It has the red, green, and black plaid lining, which he has taken care to exhibit. But further speaking once again to the iviness, the OCBD is the most prominent staple of ivy style, and tied together here with the black knit tie, its iviness is only accentuated. Also, not only is he wearing Savelge denim, but he has a large cuff, which I would guess, looking from here, is probably about two inches. And then to complete the ivy look, he has, of course, white socks and black tassel loafers. My second favorite outfit from Christmas Day comes from the Instagram account, Houndstooth and Herringbone. In the photo, he's wearing a wheat herringbone tweed sport coat with a burgundy pocket square, has on an olive ribbed turtleneck, and brown moleskin trousers. What I love most about this outfit is the color combination. You have the light brown of the sport coat, the green of the turtleneck, and the brown of the trousers, which makes up a terrific trifecta of earthy tones. And the fusion of the earthy tones is punctuated very, very nicely here with the burgundy pocket square. Further, there's a very interesting blend of textures. You have the rough surface of the tweed sport coat, then you have the ribbing of the turtleneck and the soft, almost matte, I would say, brown of the moleskin trousers. A very understated but superb outfit. My third favorite photo from Christmas Day comes from the Instagram account, and I know that I'm gonna say this incorrectly, so I apologize, Spaka Neopolis. In the photo, he is wearing a dark brown corduroy, single-breasted peak lapel suit, a denim spread collar shirt, a green and gold medallion tie with a western belt with a turquoise buckle and loop. Draped over his arm, he has a brown Glen check overcoat that seems to have a till overcheck. Foremost, what I love about this outfit is the suit itself. I love how the dark brown corduroy glistens, and I also appreciate the construction. I typically don't like single-breasted peak lapel suits, but in this corduroy fabric with the patch pockets, I really, really do. Further, I enjoy the color combination. There's a beautiful blend of earthy tones. You have the chocolate brown of the suit, the sky blue of the denim shirt and turquoise of the buckle and loops on the western belt, and the blue overcheck on the overcoat, and you also have the green and yellow of the tie. There's also a terrific blend of casual wear and work wear. A suit is, of course, formal, but this suit is made of corduroy, which is a casual fabric. And this is combined with a denim shirt and the Western belt, which both are, of course, workwear. And all this is accentuated with the medallion tie, which is more formal wear. It's a superb ensemble and combination with both casual and workwear. My fourth favorite outfit from Christmas Day comes from the Instagram account, Random Walk Shop. In the photo, he is wearing a top chunky shawl cardigan, a dark brown roll neck, a pair of accrue denim trousers, and tan suede tassel loafers. He also has on a yellow, brown, and white plaid scarf. What I love most about this outfit is its understatedness, precisely because it stacks neutrals. The top of the chunky cardigan, the dark brown of the roll neck, 
and the Ikru of the denim are all neutrals. Really, the only item that pops is the scarf, and really it's only the yellow in the scarf. There's also something interesting going on in terms of symmetry. The buttons on the cardigan are dark brown, and the turtleneck is dark brown. So the way that it presents when you are looking at it is dark brown of the buttons, top of the cardigan, dark brown of the turtleneck. Dark brown top, dark brown. Lastly, I'll admit that the tan suede tassel overs are a little too showy, and I personally probably would have opted in this case for dark brown suede tassel loafers, but I think it still works with all of the other neutrals in the outfit. My fifth and final favorite outfit from Christmas Day comes from the Instagram account, and I'm sure I'm gonna say this wrong, I apologize. Haseen Han, see the world. In the photo, he is wearing a bold red, green, beige, brown, and yellow check sport coat with a white handkerchief and a white spread collar shirt. He also has on a plain top tie, gray trousers, white socks, and burgundy monk straps. What I love most about this outfit is, of course, the sport coat. It just screams Christmas. I love the bold checks, and if I were ever to purchase a sport coat exclusively for Christmas, I would most definitely want it made out of that fabric. But he does a terrific job in this case of not overdoing it, which would be very, very, very easy with a bold sport coat like that one. A lesser dresser wouldn't have had the necessary restraint, I think, to pull an outfit off with this sport coat. He uses neutrals for the rest of the outfit. He has the white of the shirt and pocket square, the top of the tie, and the gray of the trousers. And he even uses white socks and burgundy monk straps, which in addition to being neutral, also provides an interesting symmetry to the outfit. You have the reds and browns of the checks on the sport coat up top, the gray trousers in the middle, and on the bottom you have the reddish brown of the burgundy monk straps. A terrific outfit. So there you have it, Sartorialist. Those are my five favorite outfits from Christmas Day. Let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of these outfits and whether you agree or disagree with my analysis. Otherwise, if you enjoyed this content, hit that like button, smash subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can be informed when I drop more videos on the Holsey style. Until next time, guys.